Hey Outrage developers, this is Outrage Games back with another awesome tutorial. Today we are going to learn how to make stairs like those in Guacamole in a very simple way. So let's start. First of all, I'm going to make an one way platform and I am going to use the same code for the stairs later. So I will add a box collider to the platform and then create one object with an Ease Trigger Box Collider and place it under the platform. And another one and place it over the platform like that. Now I will create a C-Sharp script and place it in both objects. Let's create a bool variable. This will check if the box is over the platform or not. Now I will use the onTriggerEnter2D function and check if the colliding object has the player's tag. If so, the parent of the current object, aka the platform, is going to have its collider enabled or disabled depending on the isUp variable. So now, in the unit inspector, I am going to enable the isUp variable at the upper box and play. It's working. Now I'm going to create a game object variable for our player. Make sure that our player's tag is player and now in the start function get the player through his tag. I have an is grounded variable in my player walking script that checks whether or not he is on the ground. So I will simply check in the update function if the player is on the ground and if he is pressing the down arrow key. and I will disable the platform. Done. Here it is. Now I will do exactly the same with the stairs, but I will add polygon colliders instead of box colliders and make the shapes like that. Here you have it, easy but effective way to make one-way platforms and stairs. If you found this tutorial helpful, make sure to smash the like button. Also subscribe for more awesome tutorials like that. If you want the project code and your awesome name to be shown at the end of every video, 
consider becoming a patron. See you in the next tutorial. Bye!